I mean, I'm so happy. Uh, it was it was a lovely experience. Um, I get a little, a little bit emotional sometimes talking about it. It was a very emotional experience to arrive there, and um, especially for the you know the cause, the a pathway through pain charity. Um, it's a, a cause that's very close to my heart, and um, and to be able to achieve this for the charity and raise funds for them is is really special for me. My wife is absolutely incredible. She has always supported me through all my crazy adventures. She supported me through my ACCA studies. I became a chartered accountant. I'm working here in this wonderful firm, Baker Tilly, and um, I've, I found swimming again. I mean, I used to swim as a young man. I was quite competitive, and now I, I've... I don't know if it's a midlife crisis or something, but I, but I really, really enjoy in swimming again, especially open water swimming. What kind of preparation goes into a swim like this? You need a lot of swim hours to prepare for something like this. Um, you always need to have another gear in, in case the current shifts and goes against you. Um, the waters get rough and swells come in uh, when you least expect it. So you need to be strong for those moments. Um, having said that, I did get excellent conditions on Saturday. So um, things panned out extremely well. Good to hear. And what was the toughest part about it? I think the, the hardest thing of the straight is, is you know what, there there's, comes a point halfway through the swim where you cannot see land I, behind you or in front of you. You're practically, I mean, you could if you stopped and looked it's very faint in the distance. Um, so you're surrounded by sea and you know that there's m big massive creatures swimming underneath you and um, if you let your if you let yourself go in that direction and think about where you're at it could be very dangerous indeed and you might you know have to get get onto the boat so I heard you came across some rails en route were you aware or were you too busy focusing on your swim I actually saw them pass right underneath me yeah. And uh, at the time I was a little bit worried, a little bit scared because um, I didn't know if, how they were going to react to me being in their environment. Um, as soon as they, were, they had passed through, then obviously I, it, it, it dawned on me that I had just been through a wonderful experience and uh, it made it even more worthwhile being there.